Hello everybody, Grace Steel Blaze, and I'm here with a game for the channel called Bendy and the Ink Machine. No time for BS. So, this was recommended to me by some folks. This is a first-person horror puzzle-style game. Very, very akin to, I guess, Hello Neighbor. Some people are drawing some similarities there. Obviously, if you can hear the background right now, that kind of weird droning background sound is the sound that is also in Hello Neighbor. So... The art style, first off, absolutely awesome. Look at this. This is like this is like old school Disney styled cartoonish drawings. Only very, very um biblically evil. I don't know. Look at this. It says Bendy and Little Devil Darling. And then we have the dancing demon. Hmm. Is it all just is it all just a coincidence? Probably not. Anyhow, this starts off with us. Uh, after 30 years, I guess, we're gonna go check out the workshop of a buddy of ours, Joey Drew. Our name is Henry, so we're gonna have to go check this out. Now, this is supposed to be a pretty freaky game. I haven't really, obviously, tried it yet, because that loses a lot of the, the potency for a horror game if you go into it the first time. And, uh, well, the last time I played a horror game, I ended up injuring myself at my desk. So let's see if we can do the same here. Onward right, we go. Joey. Oh. I'm here. Oh. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Okay, even the voice acting isn't too bad. This is a free demo. It's over on Game Jolt. I'll have a link in the description below. It's got a little bit of a descriptor to the game if you want to check that out as well, but for the most part here, let's see what we got to do. There was a disclaimer about uh, fast moving pictures and flashing lights, so if you're epileptic, watch out, I guess. We are. This is neat. Look at this. It's like everything is hand drawn. Even the cogs and stuff. Look, there's a little shading in it and everything. Very good. Nothing too scary yet. So, I don't exactly know how the controls go. Oh, E. E makes the crosshairs go on and off. We can't seem to click on anything. There's some freaky music playing in here. This is interesting. We don't have a shadow. Okay. Well, I guess right now we're just doing the, uh... Oh. No. <laughs> no what? Is there like a zoom or anything? Nope. Right click doesn't do anything either. So right now it's all exploration all the time. Whatever. Got a little picture of Bendy there. I'm assuming that's Bendy. If you notice, Bendy has little devil horns on his head. I suppose it's supposed to be his hair, but you can't fool me. I know exactly what this game's getting at. This game is getting at I the demon. Desk. Ooh. Now I've wasted so much time in this chair. Oh, Henry. You're always you're always coming out of nowhere with those comments. What do we got here? A little post-it note. Uh, oh, I can't really see what the hell it's trying to say. No. What is with this no thing? Is it just, like, no one likes the artwork or what? Oh, hand-drawn cobwebs. Can we open up any of these doors or anything? I don't know if you can, if these function? No. Or at least, at the most part, I, I don't think that there's a button that opens anything. Let us move along. That's the exit. That's where we came in, so we can't go that way. Oh, Jesus. And it has begun. It always starts with drawings on the walls, or words on the walls, I guess. We're going to check that out in a second. Uh, there's ink just coming from the ceiling. I hope that's ink. Just coming from the ceiling. Very washed out color scheme. Dreams come true. Mmm. Yeah, not for me. Not for me! Bendy and Little Devil Darling. Okay, so still the same poster. There's Bendy right there looking at us. Very, very, uh, incredigiously. I don't know if that's really the right the right descriptor for the way he was looking at us. Ink machine. Ooh. Uh we also have a hallway down this way. I guess we'll go check out the ink machine. It's calling our name, man. So Whoa. this is the ink machine, huh? Wonder how you turn it on. Uh, you and me both. Is there a switch? That is the very first thing I typically do whenever I wonder how to turn things on. Oh, there's a cog way over here. We can't pick that up either. Can't mess around with any of the the drawers. The ink machine. So what What exactly does the ink... Well, it's just a big vat of ink. So, right now, trying to... Ooh, this is a giant board. Can we move it? No. So right now, just very atmospheric. Kind of wondering exactly what we're supposed to do. Let us move on here. We're going to kind of head down this way. I think... Was this the way... Did we go this way already? I don't think we did. Oh, God. I'm starting to get turned around. What the hell is this? Oh, something works. Okay, left click. I don't get what Joey's plan is for this company. The animation sure aren't being finished on time anymore, and I certainly don't see why we need this machine. It's noisy, it's messy, and who needs that much ink anyway? Also, get this. Joey had each one of us donate something from our workstation. We put them on these little pedestals in the break room. 
To help appease the gods, Joey says. Keep things going. I think he's lost his mind. But hey, he writes the checks. But I tell you what, if one more of these pipes burst, I'm out of here. Hey, how you doing? We got the good fellas over here, huh? Yeah, if your boss told you to put some some offerings on pedestals to appease the gods, um, I don't know if I'd keep my job. That's a little bit further than a man's willing to go. <laughs> That's a little bit more than I'm willing to dedicate to a company. What we got going on over here? Okay. Room. Room with a projector. The projector is not on. Can we touch any of this? I like touching everything. Ah, flow. Okay, that is... That is very obviously a button that I cannot press. So, I guess we'll come back to it. I feel like right now, right now, something would come on in this screen. Right now. Right now. Okay, nothing's coming on in the screen. Also got little hand-drawn dust bunnies. Kind of like that as well. All right, let's continue onward here and see what we can see. Still, kind of want, now there's no, it doesn't look like there is a sprint button. There's a, oh, there is a jump, okay. And I'm not feeling a crouch. Uh, what, what was that? Thought I heard something? All right, well, maybe not. Now, I often do this crap to myself as well. Okay, the ink machine's over there. So there's still stuff that we haven't done down this way, right? We did, did we not go this way? This is the part, man. Whoa, okay. That was, what the hell is that? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Joey, what were you doing? Jesus Christ, they killed Goofy. Oh, you sick bastards. Oh, my God, they've ripped open his ribcage. And his ribs are uh, just hanging out. That's very, very creepy. This is very creepy. Yep. Yep, this is a messed up game. This is twisted. Who's laughing now? Uh, Bendy in Sheep Songs with Boris the Wolf. Oh. Well, I guess Boris the Wolf is not going to be in Sheep Songs 2. Uh, anything else going on over here? Oh, hold on. There's an ink thing. Oh, damn it. I thought maybe we could grab that. That looked like a little hidden item or something like that. All right, nothing else in here. No big deal. Just keep moving around then. I guess, did we, okay, I think we came that way. Whoa, ah! All We've... right, how do I get this to work? Click objects to collect them. Okay, here we go. We found the offering tables, whatever you want to call them. So we need, I'm assuming this is very obvious. Like you just grab the items that are pictured here on the wall. So we need a cog, a wrench, a book, uh, a doll, a music note. All right, I don't know where the hell I'm gonna find that. And a bottle of ink. Oh, we saw the bottle of ink already. Um, I wasn't really looking for the rest of the crap, so we're gonna have to wander around here. Whoa! <gasps> Shit. Oh, who put this here? Okay, so even the narrator was freaked out by that. Uh, okay, let's go grab the bottle of ink real quick, because remember, that was right over here, I do believe. Yes. Nice. Okay, bottle of ink. So now... We just need the right- now there was cogs everywhere, man, so like, which one do you grab? Like, can you grab them off the wall? Oh, can we touch this guy? Alright, I was just curious. That sounded really bad. Um... Oh, can we move this? Alright, no. Alright, moving onward. Let's check around here. Anything of note in this area? No. Oh, cog! Right? No? Can't grab those? Alright, I thought that those were cogs. They look suspiciously like cogs. Um, crap, we're gonna have to retrace our steps. Because I don't know where the rest of those items would be. Son of a bitch. Oh, no. Now, is this one of those games where it changes things on you? You know what I mean? Like, when you go one way, the, like, the room changes. How about this? Can we grab that? Man, that looked like a cog for sure. Come on, this is BS. Some of this looks like it would be useful. There's that flow button again. All right, I guess there's nothing in here of use. Um, all right, let's keep going then. Keep going down the hallway. Oh, that droning noise. It is gonna freaking, it is gonna freaking give me a, a freaking aneurysm or something like that. I'm, I'm, my own hypertension is starting to get out of whack here. I'm doing this to myself. I always do. Okay, all right. So, oh, was there anything inside the ink machine area? Might as well double check this while we're here. 
Um, how about inside of these drawers? Now, nothing inside the drawers. Now, it said that we can click on things, and we were able to click on that chunk of ink. So, oh, a cog. Can we grab that? No, we can't grab that cog either. Okay. Uh, let's see. How about around the side here? Negatory. Oh, that, yes. Okay, got it. Sweet. So, if you noticed, when our cursor ran over that cog, it, like, highlighted a little bit. So, that, that, okay. So, that can kind of tell you what you need. Let's keep moving here. Um, I was already here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we already went through here. Let's keep going this way, then. Because we had the ink machine over there. Okay. So, if we head closer to the beginning where we came in, we should probably be able to find something. All right, here's the dreams. Oh! Wrench. Nice. Okay, good. So we got the wrench. Uh, crap. What else did we need? We needed a... Oh, what else did we need? We needed a musical note. And we needed a doll. I remember those two things. Oh, boom! Yes! Oh, what a horrible little sound! Oh, you little freaking nature! Was there something behind this, this chair? No, okay. This... Oh... Uh, oh, it's those things. Jesus. Alright, how about where we came in? Is there anything kind of like lingering over here? It doesn't look like it. Alright, let's go check this area out extra well. Can I grab any of these like things? No. I just wanted to see like the paperwork and stuff like that. You never know. Can we click on this or anything? No. Is there anything else hidden? Anything else? Let's see. How about you? Can I click on you? No. That, that freaking music, man. That music is... What is this? Oh! Oh! Okay, it's a record. Alright, maybe that's the musical note. That would make sense then. Okay. So it's not like a, it's not like a physical note. Like an actual... I was, I was thinking we were gonna have to grab, like, a note. Like an actual, like, plastic note that'd be, like, lingering on the ground or something like that. I don't know what it would look like. Alright, let's head this way, I guess? Now, we, we, we've been this way, haven't we? We're looking for a book. Crap. Where am I gonna find a book? You boys like recessed ceilings? Really opens up the room, doesn't it? This is, uh... This is kind of making me hate... Disney. <laughs> I don't know why I blame you, Disney. But it's your fault for this horror. It's your fault for the drama I'm experiencing right now. Oh, book! Where the hell are you? For real, where the hell is this book at? I bet I missed it. I bet I went past it. I probably did, didn't I? I've got a lot of items here. I just don't have them all. Oh, what the hell? Oh, the items are appearing as I pick them up. Okay, that is definitely a book or like a manuscript or something. Gotta be around here somewhere. All right, let's find this freaking book and turn this damn thing on. I've, I've been not playing around. Maybe it was in this room. Is it, like, what would it look like? I mean, on the thing, it just looks like a book. It's not like a poster or something, is it? No, it's definitely not a poster. Oh, hold on. Found it. Yep, right there. Boom. <laughs> the illusion of living. All the illusion of living. No gay. Okay, that's all of them. Yep. I just need to get the ink flowing somehow. Okay. Boom, oh, What the? Then I can start up the main power. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Oh, Bendy! Oh, you little rapscallion! Oh, you... Oh, no. This is what I'm talking about, boys! Right here. This is where Bendy freaking jumps out of the projector and starts strangling us. You boys know it's gonna happen. Yes! Okay, look right there. It highlights. I knew it, man! I knew it! Things are coming together, baby! Things are working! What else is around here? I just kind of want to take a really good look at the area here. Can we sit in any of this or anything? Oh, that music. That music! Ooh. <laughs> this game has a fantastic art style. I love it. I don't know, man. Like, I'm a big... What the hell was that? Oh, is that the ink moving through the pipes or something? Man, it's like playing freaking Dead Space all over again! Freaking Xenomorphs are coming for us, except they're little cartoon-looking sons of bitches. With the giant white gloves. Um, where's the ink machine at? I think it... Oh, right over here. Cool, got it. Sweet. Alright, main power. Alright, boys. <laughs> the Illusion of Living. By Joey Drew! There's our boy! So he wrote this book. Great. 
So what do all these things have in common? What is a doll? Is this doll our guy? Because it's like slowly... Sp yeah, it's our dude. That's, uh, that's Bendy. And then we have... I guess Bendy's Greatest Hits. And then just a jar of death ink. I don't really know why you'd put a skull and crossbones on... I, I'm assuming that's ink. I guess it could be poison. I don't know. Uh, and then the liver is lighting up. So, lever on! Alright. So... That's it. Okay. Um, we'll probably have to go check that room where the, uh, where the critter is. Yeah, this guy over here. This would mean something, wouldn't it? Because this is where the... Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, I, I got it. I got it. We have to go back to that room with the actual ink machine, right? Okay, that was the offerings. So we have to backtrack a little bit. Because if I remember correctly, the machine is... Oh, is it around this corner? I feel like it is. Oh, crap. I'm getting myself lost again. Because it was around a corner, and then it was... Like, we had to make a left. You know I'm really good at mazes, right, guys? Oh, we're back in this room. Has anything changed? Nope. Nothing's changed. Still freaky. Oh, God. All right. I all, as, as long as I can get to the room... What the hell is this? Where did the boards come from? How do you take the boards down? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no, 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 fuck, no, no, negative. Shit, is there a sprint button? There's no sprint button. Ugh. My dreams are not coming true. Oh, 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 the exit, okay. Exit, 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 oh, I'm gonna jump for it. No, why, you whore? Shit! The creator lied to us. The creator? Like God or like the dude that drew Bendy? Ooh. Axe on the wall. Yes, it's lighting up. This will definitely come in handy. Clear an old path. Hold on. There's a was there more over here? And you oh. Oh wow, you can break all the wood. Can we get out this way? <laughs> no. Uh, I don't want to clear the old path. How about how about this? Oh, you can break these woods, too. But you just can't get through there. Alright, well, we'll go this way, then. Uh-huh. Okay. Game's getting a little heavy. Took a little bit to start winding up, but now things are getting kind of freaky. Not gonna lie. Out of the way, Wood. I don't have time to get get my soul eaten by a freaking dude in a costume. That looked like a dude in a... Okay, guys. See? This is what I'm talking about right here. That, there's a pentagram on the ground. We've got freaking coffins in the background. What else is in there? I'm not going in there. Well, I, I mean, I am eventually, but I'm not just going to rush on in there because we're going to get attacked. You know we are. What else is in there? we got a couple of chairs. Okay, what's everyone looking at? The chairs are facing something. There's a door over there. Hold on, let me... We're going to reels... Oh, shit. Okay. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to back away slowly from the evil. Okay, I can't back away. Well, I can back away slowly from the evil, but I want to see what's over here. Okay, we got a cabinet. And that's it. There's just a pentagram. <laughs> oh, yep. There's Bendy, boys. There he is. Mmm. All right. So, uh, yes, excellent. Support chapter two. Definitely support chapter two. So, the Meatly <laughs> Patreon dot com slash the meatly dealing with bendy and the ink machine man that was really cool this is really cool i gotta tell you the artwork the music the ambient sounds um a little slow to the build up i mean we were only playing the game for probably like 20 minutes or maybe like 15 minutes so that's really not that slow of a build up bendy will return oh i'll bet he will so that wasn't really that slow of a build up um, in the grand scheme of things, especially if you're gonna make multiple chapters. Okay, this is where the little guy pops out at us, right? Right, he's gonna jump out of the screen. Jump scare, right now. No? No jump scare? Oh, there's an after game! Yes! Ooh, you had to wait until the credits were over, boys! Wait, I can't, I can't do anything. Oh, no. No, no, no! There you go! <laughs> I almost caught my knee on the desk! Alright, guys. Hope you enjoyed Bendy and the Ink Machine. We did it! We solved the riddle of, I don't know what we solved. We got out of the, uh, we got out of the workshop area, fell down into the pits of hell, where I guess Joey Drew has been conducting satanic experiments in the name of Disney. Guys, hope you enjoyed it. Till next time, folks. Stay foxy and much love.